Yep. So today we are in the Gulf of Mexico, right? Yep. And we are in Crystal River today. So you can see we went to the marina and we put in there. It was $15, but it's well worth it because it's so easy to get in and out. And you know, they watch your drink. So you're not having to worry about if you park in the right place or wherever. So they were very nice. We also got gas here. And they also have a little I believe this is Three Sisters. This is where the manatees stay in the winter time. And uh, so you can go in here so far. This is the party area, <laughs> I would say. And uh, I want to get out of all these kayakers. Yeah. Find a place to fish or Yeah. So what they do is go in there and hang out. We may go down there later, huh? Maybe. Yeah. Because there's a lot of boats in there. Yeah, tons of kayakers. They all go down in there. That's basically all where they can go, and that's it. And uh, hang out in here. Because when you go way over there, where the big boats are, that's pretty much the ocean. So, pretty cool. Nice little area. Very busy area. We'll come out here during the week when I'm off one day, too. That'll be even better. We'll have so many people out here. So, yeah. We'll do that. Yeah. So, we're going to go out here. We're going to find a place to go fishing. So, stay tuned. And there is the smokestacks. We've taken pictures of them before. So, way too far from them at all. Pretty cool. We're just boating around, I think. I don't know if we're going to go down in there or not. They look like little boat houses over there. Ah, pretty cool. Checking everything out first. are having a fight over here. Two birds are chasing that big bird. Making lots of noise. <laughs> this is kind of cool. 
private property. He's got it all over, so he's probably had problems. That's a different looking house, isn't it? Yep. Strange looking. He's got his own little boat launch here. Nice. Very nice. Ah, look. They got one of those pirate play area things. Yeah. Yeah, for kids. That's cool. Neat. little island that says posted no trespassing I think that'd be a nice little place for you to go camping in <laughs> yeah. no hunting it says no trespassing so somebody probably owns it. a bird. And there he goes, flying away. Hi birdie. There's something sticking up over here. I don't know what Probably a branch. I don't know. Going under. May not be much. Yeah, yeah. Be cool. This is cool in here. Neat. Yeah. Really neat. And it comes back out again. A cutie, but he's little. A hey, tiny guy. Yay! We're using shrimp. Okay. Bye. bye, fishy. See you later. Off he goes. This is a nice little area in here. So, anyways, we're using shrimp today. So, I got my first one. I'd like to catch something else. That would be cool. You know. But we'll see. Stay tuned. Cottages over here. They're cute. Put that over there. Pretty neat. That'd be a nice weekend. Get away. Maybe a couple of weeks. <laughs> I probably never want to leave. Yeah. So we're back out here. Pretty neat. You have to do idle speed in here because of the manatees are in here, so you have to be careful. Here we go. Lots of houses around here. Lots of people out today. Yeah.
and so he was, I was, um, excuse me, trying to fish again, and he had his rod in that thing, and I brought my rod back up because the fish I had ate my shrimp, so we put, he was getting me another shrimp, and his pole went right into the water. That fish dragged it. It must have been a big fish because it dragged that pole and we couldn't get it. It went down. So now he's going to have to get him his new pole. And he's not really worried about the pole. It was that, the reel he had bought. It was a vintage reel that he really liked. So he kind of got upset. Of course, I would be too. And I told him we'll get him another one if we can find one. They're very rare to find. So. Anyways, we'll get him another rod and we're going to head home. So I'm sitting here waiting for him to bring the truck over so um, we can put the tow truck, I mean the, the boat back on the uh, trailer. So anyways, it was a nice day either way. It's too bad about his, his rod. I would have liked to have seen that fish too. We didn't get to see it either. It just dragged it. So it, could, it had to be pretty big. So anyways, we'll come out here again, um, maybe during the week when it's not so busy. Those weekends here are very busy, especially right now. It's summertime, the kids are all out of school. You know, it's just really busy right now. So we'll try to come back out here when we get us new fishing rod and pull. And it's just a shame. But it happens, you know, and it's just life. So anyways, my kids are just out for now. I hope you enjoyed the video and we'll be back again. I'm sorry about the wind. There's not